Okie dokie, my mighty friends. Tim here once again. I'm going to do another uh, video game series uh, type of video. And let me do a top five uh, for my one of my favorite uh, video game franchises. Um, and that is Legend of Zelda, starting with um, A Link to the Past... Very fun game where you gotta uh, try to uh, save Hyrule and defeat uh, Gan uh, Ganon. And, um, you know, with the se um, save the seven sagas. Fun game. It's just, I had to use that as a, as a uh, six because there's so many other, like, Wonderful games that I just, uh, I, of course, put that as a six, though. Let's start with number five, and that is Ocarina and Time. Love this game. And let's just say, my God, the story of Grog. I got to do a top five emotional <laughs> moments in Zelda, because Jesus Christ... I'm ordering the 3DS counterpart of this game because I just love it so much. And uh, fun game. Again, emotional parts, but just a fun game. And Link is just badass. Number four is the 1986 Legend of Zelda. Fun game. Released with NES. Um... I'm not one of those people that go, oh, it's cheesy or um, it's way above its time or whatever. It's overrated. I love this game. One of the first few games I really, really enjoy that still to this day, I just adore it. Number three, which is considered one of the greatest I somehow agree, you know. I watched Nerd's video, you know, his review or his episode. I still love this. I love the, uh, the, the controls, the side quests, you know, Andrew's anguish or the friggin' them with the whole abduction. Oh, my God. And such emotion into a friggin' game lay The Legend of Zelda. Just, if you want to literally check out Majora's Mask, definitely recommend. Especially if you want to get into gaming. Uh, like, get away from stuff like PS4, 5 related, and want to get into, like, um, earlier stuff, check that one out. You would not be uh, really, like, missing out a lot of, like, really cool gaming. Number two goes to Zelda 2, The Adventures of Link, which I'm on the minority where I think this is magnificent. There's people that don't like it, like it, hate it, don't hate it, I love it, or whatever, uh floats your boat i enjoy this my favorite it even has my like favorite quest one of my favorite quest uh link second quest it is an unbelievable uh you know entry for the series and again it's still this was still like this was released in 88 I recommend check it out. If you want to, again, if you kids want to get into NES stuff, check this one out. Now, my all-time favorite Zelda game, it's got to be the Wind Waker. Wind Waker is one of the funnest, one of the most funnest, one of the most awesome Comfortable, comfy, nicest experiences I've ever had for a game. It has 
a lot to look forward for with especially this game. And I love how you get to sail group groups of islands and you know you you uh got to save your sister from Ganon. You can, you know, go on these really fun little quests, really fun quests, you know, if it's Z- Zunari or uh you know, doing so much really fun things, very Kingdom Hearts esque, uh, with playing Sora and going through all these different villages and islands um, before you meet, uh, you know, the Disney crew or whatever. Uh, this game kind of gives me that vibe. If you know what I'm talking about, the very beginning of Kingdom Hearts, this game kind of reminds me of that. So, this is my number one favorite. So those are my top five, well, with an added six, favorite uh, Legend of Zelda games. Hope you like this. See you soon.